Hello everyone, this is GrayShot117 doing a generic introduction, like all my other videos. Very generic, right Sean? Mm. In any case, Fair. I am finishing off, hopefully, uh, this army shortly. Again, I would rather wait for them to hit me and then I can take them out. With me, as well, is currently, well, Sean. Currently doing fine as the uh, Hojo. They're uh, right now in the... Well, at war with the Eco Iki, and they're so far doing okay. I would have to say, could be better, but also could be a lot worse. Meanwhile, so this guy, if, as long as I defeat his last Providence, should be relatively fine. I am most likely going to go go to war with the uh, another tribe, which are the uh, Shimazu, take over this piece of territory over here. With that. Should be in a better position. At least I do have a uh, location over here by the... What the heck? Iku Iku, you're attacking me. Should I just auto-resolve this? Yeah, just auto-resolve. Oh, that's his Daimar. Oh. I was <laughs> kind of hoping I could bribe this army. I just saw your number go down. It was just losing, dropping. Oh, shit. I was trying to prepare an army there. All right. You can hold out. Plans. Can I? Yeah. You can absolutely I fight. There we go. He's attacking with multiple armies, and looks like you have a reinforcing army, right? I do have reinforcements. Okay, well, you can yeah. cut off. What are those? Oh, wait, no. I would say get in the base before you attack. Hmm. That would be the smarter move, to get into the, your own base. Ah, oh, but Krishad, I'm not you. I don't make smart types of decisions. Sean, you make great decisions. They're just... Usually, uh... They're, they're just sometimes flawed. Yeah. <laughs> I, I wasn't gonna say that, but, you know. All right, looks like on the left we have a bunch of Iko Iki, just basic troops. Um, up the gut we have, once again, more basic troops, nothing major. And then his main assault force is comprised of a lot of archery. Holy shit, that's a lot of archery. And then samurai, or lone, long sword. No, lone swords. Lone sword. I originally like long swords as in like civilization, but you're right, they're loans. Yeah, it's a um, unique unit for the Goiki. They're swordsmen, but they're levy tier. They're the only ones that are, have access to them. Well, as these guys charge and in. Unlike other clans, you can actually build them because they don't require an incredibly specific set of buildings to get. Well, they're currently advancing on your position, slowly but surely. Yeah. It's part of the plan. Oh, nice. You're knocking those guys out at the wall. Did they get up? I like how they're just standing still. Come on, spike them. Poke them. Poke them. Our general is in grave danger, my lord. Then you poke faster. No, oh, Archers, stop that. Stop shooting your own men. I, I don't understand why guys outside the wall just lose all their confidence so quickly. What? But it looks like you might be able to get inside before the other army on the left can regroup. And that should allow you to hold. That or you could make a charge toward all, all their... Uh, <clears throat> excuse me. A lot of their guys. But that could be very but why risky. Why are you losing so many men? Right, long swords. Are they? Do they have long swords? No, these are just spearmen. So Maybe tell your uh, bowmen to hit the guys coming in on the other side. Because admit, are you hitting your own guys? Shouldn't be. All right, they're moving up. Uh, long uh, lone swords toward your guys along the wall. I don't think they'll be able to hold. Wow, his men are actually massacring mine. What? What the shit? They're legit massacring my troops. Oh, your general's dead. 
Yeah, that happens. Fuck, fire's coming down now. But hey, they'll keep fighting. 153, 212, 91. And you have 1, 10, 11. Yeah, that's uh, not expected. My man just got massacred. What happened? I have no idea. Holy crap, the fire arrows. Our men are Holy shit. Shameful display. Mm. Well, this was a failure. Well, you did more damage than you would have. If you just auto resolved it. Yeah, I suppose that's true. Oh, there goes all those horses that, that were supposed to be. I was building up for a huge defense there, and they rushed too fast. My empire is now split. <sighs> all right. Meanwhile, I have this, and I have to worry about this guy. It's slightly in your favor. Yeah. Let's uh, fight. Okay. So good, my. Oh, boom. you're see. Oh, you're in the siege. Yeah, they're attacking a castle. I was oh. actually gonna go attack them, but they attack. They wanted to attack me first, which I'm fine with. Hmm. Right now, I'm just keeping my guys and putting them where I need to, so that way, if I need to reinforce. I have guys all over the place ready to move in. I don't think they're going to come through the by the backwater area. But I could be very wrong. Oh, look. I am very wrong. God damn, it's so foggy. Yeah. They probably decide to attack during the fog. It's like which it reduces uh, visibility and accuracy of ranged units. It's like, guys, can we just, could you do me a favor and just attack during the day? It makes it a lot, it makes it look a lot better for the courting. Well, it is actually during the day. I mean, like, less foggy. Like, midday. Yeah. It wouldn't be foggy midday. I guess the AI is not being considered as if you're, um... Recording, I know. YouTube I know. Hmm. Fledgling. So Aren't you coming off on your six-year anniversary? Yep. Mm, fledgling. Very small, I know. Mm. Alright, let's prepare the reserves. Because they're going to have to rush in. Alright. They're pushing in on the right with a ton of uh, Yariashgari. Left hand side, we have more bowmen. My bowmen are ready to go. Are they outside? You motherfuckers, get inside! What happened? What? They're outside the wall. play wow just in just fucking massacre those yari yep it didn't break though it's amazing
your um, bow that your girl are suffering badly. You might want to spread them out a bit. Spreading them. Spread them. I'm gonna spread them. Alright, gonna do a cavity search. Spread them. Right, my men seem to be holding just fine. That being said, go we'll cut him down. Let's increase confidence on the right. <laughs> uh, I'm watching one of your um, arches moonwalk around the entire map. It's pretty funny. You know, it's been holding the, the one thing I make sure that my archers know what to do is, is uh, dance well. If their yeah. dancing skills are not up to par, it, there's a problem. Yeah, I don't know if you're seeing this, but one of your archers has been holding the bow for ages. I can believe it. He's like, I'm just trying to get a better shot. It's like, you can't see them. Just fire where they are. It's like, well, I don't know. Don't you fucking leave, I swear to god. I don't know why you guys keep like, hey guys, let's leave. It's like, no. Our general is in grave danger, my lord! Our general is not in grave danger. Our general is doing fine. <clears throat> Take them down, men. Well, you're just about one. If you've used all your ammunition, that's fine. Then throw bodies. Yes. <clears throat> you know, it can actually be a bad thing to send your archers in. Because when a unit routes, there's a chance that it will cause its neighboring unit to route. My lord! A glorious victory will soon be yours! Alright, they're retreating. Well done. All thanks to the skills I learned from you, Sean. Yes. Remember that when you're sieging my capital. <laughs> Will do. Oh god, I did lose the vetted unit.
But they still lost a heck of a lot more than I did. God. You go here so close to my capital. They... Do they just drop off another army? I wouldn't know. Oh my god. Don't... They dropped off another army. I swear to... No, they didn't. They just... They have their navy there. Mm. Like, alright, sure, cool. Matt, more rebels. I could probably actually win this one. I will spectate. This castle's pretty good. They're all coming from one direction. Do they have any bowmen? No, it's all spearmen. Alright, then you hold that line. Today, men, we see an army marching toward us. But we'll wait, you see, to them is... Down with their emperor. Or, I guess, leader. Shogun? That's so bad. It's so bad. <laughs> is it that bad, though? <clears throat> yeah, and if it was made. I believe you guys can hold. Uh, yeah, I'm confident. We probably shouldn't be, but I am. I think if your general. The guy in the red, uh, the red coat? Yeah, it's probably the one that's unique. I think it's the one the red one, uh, the red uh, shirt. Hold on. Mm. Any more red shirts? There's not a red yes. shirt. Okay, so I found the red shirt, which actually typically means he's gonna die. But red that shows so that no one sees him bleed. Inuiki. Oh, these are Inuiki forces. Rebels. Yeah, they're climbing up. So they are technically a different clan. Why aren't you General poking them around? Grave danger, my lord. Keep poking. Don't stop poking. You keep poking, men. Oh, they're losing a lot. You're also losing a lot, but they're losing definitely a lot. Go, 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 go. That's right, you hold. Tear down these rebels. My lord, a glorious victory will soon be yours. Good job, Sean. Yep, that's how it's probably done. Did your general die? Maybe doesn't matter. Well, don't it, it, if he lives, that don't can't you recruit him? No. Oh, I I thought you could recruit them. Yeah, it randomly pops up going. Do you want to spend a thousand? Income to have a liability. I mean, to be fair, it may not be that big of a liability. If your demo has a low honor, then your generals are more likely to betray you. Oh. An and army that doesn't have a general can't betray you. Come on. Why do I feel like that should be the opposite? Because you're a rational human being? Yeah. Okay, so... I could, I could see where there could be issues with the Inuit keep approaching your home providence. Yeah. But I feel like this is where you counterattack. Yes. That is actually exactly what I'm doing. Oh nice, you got a providence. I'm gonna murder you. It's not gonna be in your sleep or anything. Just, I want you to know that it's coming. Okay. General rank increased. A worthy so bride. Would... Ooh. A loyal retainer officer's daughter's hand in marriage. Oops. Shouldn't have done that. Uh. What's the um, wife give you? Loyalty. Oh. That's always valuable. I think I'm just gonna quickly chop this guy down. As one does. Sorry. My demo's better than your demo. Oh god, the Katsumi have lost another province. God, they might die without your intervention at all. Who? This set. Shimazu. The people to the far left, the green yeah. ones. 
Yep. How negative are they? Seven. The army's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. So I need to keep five guys here. Are you serious? Uh, all right, fine. Wait, if I exempt them from tax, what does that do? It means that they don't have unrest from taxation. But you don't get their income. Okay. I probably should have explained that to you earlier. I thought you knew. Well, no, I, j I didn't know if there was any negative penalty from that. Yeah, you just don't get the gold income. Okay, but now it's 11. It improves the growth of the region, though. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. Okay, so I only need to leave one guy here. Okay. That's fine with me. Get back in the boat. Go back inside. Back in your box. Let's be very careful. Oh, it's only two ships. Okay, we, we got that. Let's just sail around. Okay, and the next turn we'll attack the Awaji over here, neutralize whatever he probably has left, which is nothing, and be fine. Get some money back, because their fleet will be gone. And then we can go attack the uh, one tribe that's currently falling apart. Okay. Oh, no. <laughs> this guy is a, a demo that currently has... Only himself. Mm. That's a mistake. I, lo I, lo I love it. This guy's like, I'm going to c conquer. <laughs> I'm going to rule this world. And he, he got like 40 drunk buddies with him. He's like, yeah, man, we're, we're, we're with you on that. And then uh, this my full army comes in and they're like, oh, no. Um, You know what? Y we're good. We're good. You have fun. We're good. But hey, keep yourself on uh, defense mode, Sean, and I'm sure you'll be fine. Remember, def not? defense mode. Okay, so yes, I may be bankrupt. I don't think that's such a big deal. It is. He was on each turn. You were bankrupt. So here's the new uh, demo fighting me. Oh, he killed two men. Good job. What? No, go that way, please. Thank you. Oh, another new demo. I killed two demo for the price of one. So, are they done? Wait. The Hojo are still alive? No, no, sorry, not the Hojo. No, the, sorry, they're dead. Never mind. I was like, I got worried for a second. I am the Hojo. Yes, I know. You scared me, though. As I should. Alright. So, technically speaking, how do I get my uh, Deimos uh, reputation back up? Creating vassals, heroic winds, uh, some techs. God yeah. damn it. Becoming bankrupt is a big deal. Okay, so we'll leave a reserve force. Hold on. Shit. Uh, no, you guys leave. Leave. There we go. How negative are you? Two. Perfect.
Well, I just wonder keep. how long before they throw it All right, we'll head back to that castle. Meanwhile, while that war is currently underway, let's prepare for our new campaign. Oh God! Okay, note to self: we need more ships. Wait, why isn't my port getting an income? Hold on. Is it blockaded? No. Is the trade? Uh, trade income zero. Why is my trade income zero? Do you have any trade partners? Oh, god damn it. No, my neighbor. That's why. The Shoni. Wait. Let me double check diplo uh, diplomacy. Nope, nope. That's not diplomacy. Here we go. Mori, who are you at war with? You are at war with the Shoni. And the Shoni are literally right by your doorstep. But... On the flip side, oh, they wow, they like you. Um, but the Shoni are at, only at war with the Mori and the Shimazu, so they're at war with both parties. So actually, it may not be that bad to kill them real quick. And is that Shimazu? So we'll quickly deal with these guys that make our neighbors a little happier. Hopefully. Um, I need to make yes. some more. I, I'm trying to figure out a way to make money. Disband troops. Disband your fleet. Make trade agreements. Right. Uh, and no one already trading with most people. Not trading with me. You don't have trade ports open. No. Shame. Alright, what is this place? Okay, this place is pretty good. So oh damn it, that's a really good unit. Um Damn it, you're positive. Alright, how do I disband units? Uh Click on them. All right. And then where you normally hit the withdraw, that's the disband button. All right, that helped me not at all. Shit. What's your greatest expense? Army upkeep. It's gonna have to be army that you have to remove then. Ah, uh, damn it. been upgrading your farms? Haven't had time to. Hmm. There we go. Hopefully, I can go kill them. Alright, so new plan. We're not gonna kill the Shimasu yet. We're gonna kill the uh, Shoni. Oh, god damn it. Alright, they have nothing there. I can easily launch my men. Let's do it. Okay, so. Real quick. Uh... Yeah, we'll be fine. We'll be totally fine. We can actually start building up a navy as well. Let's Bane. Uh, actually, no. Let's not build that yet. Let's get the happiness over here so I can start taxing these suckers. I mean these good people. Mm -hmm. these, these, these good, honest, working people. Hard working people. Wait! Land there. Oh my god, really? I have to go to the freaking po- Okay, fine. No, just- Oh my god. Just- Can I- Can I just- Go here? You know what? Screw it, fine. Declare war. There we go. We'll attack that next turn. Small army there. We can deal with it. All right. Navy, just hold on, hold that territory for the time being. And uh, all right, there we go. In any case, it's gonna be it for this episode as they launch my assault at the uh, Shimazu. Try to gain some 
requested territory. Hopefully help Amori out by allowing them to gain some territory. Maybe call them in as, as an alliance. We shall see. Diplomacy. That's also... Well, we're hostile and at war with the Shimazu. Doesn't mean we can't be friends with everyone else. Who do the Shimazu hate? Okay, the Shimazu, uh... Currently... Come on. Oh, they hate the Shoni, the Speak Sagari, care. and oh, me. Wonderful. And you Iki like me, that's cool. Mm -hmm. I'm kidding, I'm kidding. Okay, they have nine provinces. Mighty affluent. Well, great. I'm so I'm so glad you're doing wonderful, guys. In any case, this is gonna be it for this episode. Thanks for watching, I'll see you guys next time. Hello everyone, this is Grayshaw, and before I go, I want to give a special shout out to Joey, Ace, Leo, Nick, and Tim. Thank you guys so much for your awesome support. You guys rock, and I'll see you guys next time.